So I'm just setting up a little temporary deal over here. Was going to bring y'all back when uh, I was finished with it, but uh, Mr. Nia joined and thought I would say hello. Um, I'm gonna get some food going. Because, uh, man. Yeah, I'm just making like a very temporary little, little, uh, what's your jigger? What's your jigger? Little what's your jigger? Yep. So this was just, uh, I think I found this, this little temporary base design on Reddit uh, a long time ago. It's just like a little, uh, it's very compact. It has enough storage for three double chests minimum, three furnaces, crafting table, and a bed. For the agenda today, we need to get wool, uh, we need to get food, and that'll probably take the whole episode. Um, I will go ahead and grab these chickens though. Yeah, everybody, everybody just uh, kind of go down there. No, come, 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 come down here. Yes, thank you. Oh, we got two of them. Two out of three eggs, man. That's pretty good. Just trying to do this stuff at night is a nightmare. I thought of a base idea that might be kind of cool. Uh, depends. I really need some more food. Um, but I was thinking probably in that mountain there, dig out like a little, um, a little lab or something, but it, it could be pretty cool, it allows for a lot of, um, customization, uh, because, you know, I mean, you're digging underground, so you have a lot of room for expansion, and, uh, and then you don't have to decorate it on the outside, you know, you just gotta worry about the inside, you know. I'm uh, just deciding where I'm going to put it exactly. So I'm just doing a bit of exploring here. Um, I found a swamp and some cows, but um, oh yeah, it's definitely a village. Look at this. See, so you're a nitwit, you're not, uh, you not don't even have a job. Well, I could steal one of these guys' beds, I suppose. I mean, they're not needing them. Yeah, they're not useful to me. Oh, somebody raided it, that's why. Yep. I stole the blast furnace. Man, what a guy. Come in here and steal their stuff. I mean,. Who would think you would do something like that? Hmm, somebody might actually um, be in this area. It's like they were digging a something. Some kind of tunnel. They probably uh, wanted easier access to this village. It doesn't look like they got very far, though. So, um, doing a little more exploring, and I stumbled across, uh, this area. Um, I almost kind of like this area better. Um, we've got that over there, which would be a perfect mountain to dig into, um, for our base idea. We've got water over here. Um, if you want to, um, I don't know, just like building next to the water, it makes traveling a little easier. I think I mentioned that, uh, in the previous episode. Um, and look, we've got horses too. So, uh, that's nice. I have not, uh, explored over there yet. But over here we got sheep, pigs, chickens, uh, there were some cows not too far over there. Um, 
Only thing is, it's a little far from the dark oak forest, and I did kind of like that dark oak. Um, so, I mean... <clears throat> and of course, about the water, I did mention I don't like being surrounded by water. I like having a uh, access to a waterway, but I don't like being surrounded by water. Just want to clarify that. Because that was probably kind of confusing. Uh, but I'm liking this spot a little better than my current one. And uh, according to um, the regulars, it does not seem to be claimed, and I don't see any signs of civilization. So, um, I mean, this could be potentially our new base location. I don't. Um, Oh, it's probably we could just dig in right here and just uh, get something going. Why don't we just go ahead and... Alright, well I've just got a little temporary pad set up here. Uh, yeah, just a little it's a temporary thing with a bob over here. Um, let me go ahead and sleep. <coughs> There is, uh, this is not a 100% uh, vanilla server, there's a few, um, you know, little quality of life uh, plugins. One of those is better sleeping, that one person can speed up the night, that's nice. Um, there's some others too, I, I forget, um, but you know, again, they're like, they're just little quality of life things, stuff that, um, the game probably needs anyway. But, you know, I think they wanted this to be a genuine vanilla experience as much as was possible, you know. Um, so, uh, I think I have made my, my decision. I think I do want to build the base here. Uh, that could be a mistake. Uh, I don't think so. I hope not. Um, but, uh, I think what I will do, I'm going to go and bring over the stuff from the other place, go ahead and put the coordinates, yeah, yeah, I think it's, it's about maybe 100, 200 blocks over there. <laughs> I just want to show you guys, this is actually, it's not very far at all, I just, I just ran from that way for about like two minutes and there's the village and the village is not far from um, the old base at all so it's actually a lot closer to Dark Oak than I thought it was so I, I'm I, I'm sticking with that decision to put the base over there So, um, I made it back to the, to our little, uh, temporary base, uh, I got lost, and it's, uh, it's night time now, um, and I forgot my bed, so, yeah, get that going for me, um, so I'm just gonna go ahead, I'm gonna bring all of my valuables with me, I think I want that, I want that, um, I need the pickaxe, want the rails, the name tag, the boat. So, I must have gotten, like, really lost before uh, on my way back. Because, um, see, here's the thing. Uh, that, my, that new base location, it's literally, like, right over there. Like, I mean less than 200 blocks and it must have taken me a solid like I don't know 20 minutes <laughs> to get back here so uh, I'm not really sure what happened uh, but I got lost like legit lost like I was thinking that I had to travel through 
the dark oak forest to get there, but I don't actually. It's not even, there's not even a dark forest, dark oak forest, that direction. Um, so I'm not sure how that happened. But I mean, it's, it's literally like right over here. Like, I'm not even kidding. Like, uh, okay, well, I'll have to, uh, Yeah, like, here we are. Like, it's right here. <laughs> it's, I mean, it is literally right here. Like, I didn't even think, I didn't even know it was that short of a distance just now. Like, I thought it would take a, a minute more to get there, but no, we're literally, like, just outside of render distance. And it legit, legit took me, like, 20 minutes to get there earlier from here. So, uh, I got, like, seriously lost so uh, really only have enough time today there's two different things there we go um, to just get started here we'll get the base set up um, get you know, build that li this little little bit of infrastructure going and uh, get this figured out uh, and I wanted to go caving a bit and uh, get some resources uh, we're pretty low on stuff here so we'll try to resolve that remember how I said I forgot those pumpkin seeds back at the other place there are pumpkins like right here so I wanted to set up, um, I mean, it would it'll, it'll basically be a series, it'd be like a long hallway with rooms on either side. Um, I'm trying to think, you know, how, um, how big I want it to be, how, you know, all that. Um, and as for what we're going to build it out of, I mean, I, I don't know, I don't know yet. We'll have to figure that out as we go here. Um, I do want it to be a 3x3, three three. eventually we'll put a um, piston door in, I know how to do that, uh, it's been a while since I built one, but I do remember how to do it, I think, and something we need to, uh, what, anyway, something I want to set up is a um, easy access mine, and I might just put it in right here, to be honest. Just put in some trap doors and some ladders and just, you know, dig down. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, I see some wood. Okay. Uh, you know, I bet this is part of that mine shaft that we found uh, last episode. Because this is not f far. Yeah, this is not far at all. Um, it's probably from the same mine shaft. <laughs> and it, this uh, this mine shaft is huge. I've been running through it for the last couple minutes here. I mean, it just goes on and on and on. I haven't been finding a whole lot of stuff in it though, mostly just a little. So uh, let me know, um, by the way, if my, the microphone quality has improved at all from the last episode. Um, I mean, here's the thing, it's just this microphone is almost too good actually. I think it's meant for like, you know, group... Uh, what you call it, it's like where multiple people are the same room and you're recording, or you know, maybe recording instruments or something, you know, there's a lot of different recording perspectives in the same room, you know, so it's just, it just picks like everything up. No time to say goodbye. That seems to be a theme on this server. As uh, Mr. Rex 
has informed me earlier. <laughs> Um, <laughs> hey, it's not like me. I'll, I'll stick around awkwardly and wait for people to tell me bye. So, uh, time to eat more important than time to say goodbye. I understand completely. Anyway, this, uh, so this microphone, it just like, it just picks up everything. So uh, I found um, a way to reduce a lot of the background noise, and uh, hopefully uh, that's good enough. Um, it's never a problem over um, Discord, because uh, it has uh, that software um, crisp built into it that um, intelligently cuts out all the background noise. And I wish uh, I could use that for my recording, but they do. They have that's like a subscription basis, and you know I'm in I'm in Ohio. Please don't kill me. I want to live. Um, but it's it's a subscription service. I don't think I ever looked in this chest over here. And so I can't really, uh, I can't justify it because, um, I'm kind of poor. <laughs> I'm in, I'm in school, I can only work part-time, don't judge me. Um, ooh, melons, okay. I am happy with that. Uh, so, I mean, it, it, it was... It had a subscription, and I just can't justify paying that. Plus, I don't really... I don't think I, I could justify it also in just the amount that I would use it. I mean, I just don't see myself using it enough to justify it. So, <laughs> look for alternative um, methods. And it seems to work decently. You can still... I mean, you can still hear it uh, in the background. It's just, it's nowhere near as um, disruptive <laughs> as it was before. And yes, disruptive is the right word. Ooh, that's impressive. They didn't die. Those try it was tridents. They're legit. I see that was a marketing strategy. The advertising is uh his shop. Speaking of markets, uh, we do have access to that dark oak forest, so I wonder if we should start like a, uh, I don't know, like a soup kitchen or something. <laughs> that could be um, interesting. That we just, um, I don't know if we'll um, give out the food for free, but, um, you know, maybe we could. Uh, I don't know, having like a, um, you know, an honor payment system where, you know, people just throw in whatever, you know, whatever junk they have, you, it's just, you know, just so that they're, they are paying, but it's, it'll be cheap, you know, so there won't be like a, um, won't be an obligation where you get to pay like, you know, whatever, an iron for a soup or something, and I don't want anything ridiculous like that. I want people who um, who are kind of poor on the server to be able to uh, 
purchase stuff from it, you know. Because I know, I know the feeling, man. You get, um, you first join a server and you ain't got nothing and you gotta go out and get stuff and build up your infrastructure and, you know, you just don't really have anything, you know, of value. Especially not blue shinies. So, uh, I don't really know how many other new people there are on the server, though. I think I might be the newest addition, but I'm not... Uh, don't quote me on that. Because, uh, I mean, I, I'm, I haven't been too active on here uh, lately. The last couple of days. Um, but, there may be more people joining, potentially, so... Just keep it in mind for the future. I'm lost. Yeah, as um, as great as this mine shaft is, I should probably head further down and try to find some blue shinies because that is the currency on the server. As well, you know, I have a shield. Why am I not using it? Um. As well, I need blue shinies for um, infrastructure. <laughs> I need some armor. I need an enchanting table. Uh, oopie boots. So, uh, I mean, really, really need to get on that. That's kind of what my goal was with <laughs> digging down. Oh, oh, I, I walked right over that and did not see it. Wow. Yeah, I'm also, uh, I'm pretty blind sometimes, um, so, kind of running out of time for this episode, however, so, um, I uh, want to go back, if I can remember where I am, I want to go back to that spot that we dig down at, and, um, continue to dig down. So I just set up like a little branch mine down at diamond level. Um, and then that will probably be all we have time for today. Working on that gunpowder shop too. So much freaking gunpowder. Okay, let's see if I remember where... Oh my gosh, I just did a complete circle. This might be a little while. Yeah, I don't know if um, you guys have probably noticed by now, but um, my sense of direction is uh, is excellent. You know, I mean, I never get lost. I always know where I'm going. I'm being sarcastic, by the way. Uh, my sense of direction is absolutely terrible. Like, I mean, I'm not even. I'm not being sarcastic at all. That's why you've probably noticed I put my torches on the right hand side when I'm exploring a cave or, or a mine shaft or something. And that way, if I want to retrace my steps, well, the torches are on the left now. And I just make my way back and see, here we are at the uh, dig down spot. Hi. So, but you know, I, I need a system like that because my sense, sense of direction is just so terrible. I mean, legit, when I'm like driving through uh, my, my home city in real life, uh, I, I mean, I need a GPS. Like, if I'm going anywhere except like, you know, the main drag, like I need a GPS because my sense of direction is just, is just that bad. All right, I'm down here at diamond level. Um, really? Huh. <laughs> uh, I forgot what side I wanted the ladders on. Great. 
I guess this time. This side will be fine. Um. <clears throat> so I suppose we'll have a branch going out this way. And then from there we will have um, stuff, things. Catch is still not great. I got I got it better, uh, but uh, yeah, it, it's the the big issue is uh, I'm just I just don't have good internet where I live, and it's so frustrating because the the uh, the big uh, internet company out here has a monopoly, and uh, they take full advantage, full advantage. Um, my inventory is. Full. So, uh, I'm kind of just stuck with the um, internet that they installed back in like 2004. So, for the most part, I'm using uh, cellular data for my internet. So, yeah, it's not um, not ideal, but you know it works. Can't complain too much, even though it is kind of expensive compared to regular internet. Okay, so I think I wanted. Uh, we'll have a main branch right here. We're going one, two, three, four, five, and then we'll start digging that way over here. Things. Uh, that way over here, and we'll set up doors. So just be like a little branch mining operation here, right? Yeah. <clears throat> and this will just be for like, just come in here anytime, just grab some diamonds, and then head on back up. So I'm going to do a little bit of mine. You know, something that occurred to me as I was digging here um, is there's actually a new method for finding diamonds, uh, the clay method. I heard it briefly explained um, from a different video I was watching. Uh, there is a swamp over by here, actually. It's within, um, it's, it's about a day's walk from my base. So that may be advantageous. Um... Uh, I'd have to go watch the video again to uh, figure out how it works, but um, yeah, I mean, uh, that might be worth it. Uh, I don't know. <clears throat> it does seem to be, seem like people have been around in this area before, because there is little signs of people here and there. I'll see a piece of cobblestone or a, a torch or a, um, a boat trail carved out, you know. Um, but, uh, I mean, other than that, you know, nobody's set up over here. I'm not exactly sure why that is. They explained to me that, like, 80% of everybody on the server just went north. Ooh, okay. Ooh, some gold. Uh, and, uh, I'm, I'm not really sure why. So they told me when I joined, like, you know, hey, this plenty of untouched lands off to the south, you know, I was like, oh, okay, sure. Um, so that's, that's where I went. <laughs> and it, that, that is, does seem to be the case. I've only encountered one base and I'm, um, oops, I am, you know, 1500 blocks from spawn and I've only encountered one, one base. In fact, looking at the map, you can only see one base for you know from here to um, spawn. A little lava. My pickaxe is about done. And my inventory as well. Pooby. I guess we don't need string that much. 
Oh, and there goes the pick. Okay, well, that's that's probably a good spot to go ahead and end it anyways. Uh, this episode is getting there. I, I'm gonna... I, I can't decide, um, you know, how long to make the episodes. I think it'll probably be just be pretty random. You know, I'll probably try to... I, I won't go any shorter than 10 or 15 minutes, but I probably won't go any longer than a half hour. Uh, I think it'll just depend. You know? Um... But we'll see, kind of, you know, I, I imagine, like, for community advent, community, co let me try that again. Community events, uh, it will probably be a little longer. Um, let me get some, uh, iron down here. Uh, oh, ladders. But, um, you know, for, um, you know, stuff where I'm just kind of doing this kind of thing. Uh, it'll probably just be however much, you know, time I've got on my hands and how it works out, and, you know, all that. <clears throat> so, but with that, I think, um, go on ahead and sign off. Have obligations. <sighs> I hate when life gets in the way of video games. Do you guys hate that? Gee, I just want to play some. I just want to play Minecraft, okay? Goodness gracious. Is that too much to ask? But no. Uh, so I'm going to get some stuff going here. And, uh. Hopefully. Next time, we will be able to get some stuff done, because I did not get any anywhere near as much stuff done as I wanted to today. Let's get another pickaxe going. Oh, let's get that stuff planted. So we got some redstone and some lapis, still no diamonds. Um, that's kind of a bummer. But uh, anyway, yeah, I'll um, see you guys later, and um, you know, hopefully, I will join me for the next episode. Again, um, you know, I don't, I don't claim to be like, a, you know, a, a pro YouTuber or anything. Uh, but you know, I, I do put effort into these, and I do enjoy making them. So uh, you know, I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Uh, let me know, you know, I mean, sometimes it's, uh, you know, don't get me feedback, or, you know, I don't really have, have that big of a subscriber base, so, sometimes I just don't get me feedback, and, uh, you know, it, it helps a lot to have that feedback, because, uh, it lets me know when I'm doing right, you know, when I'm not doing right. And these people just don't want to grow. Um, so, you know, leave a comment, let me know how I'm doing, or ask me how I'm doing. That's, that's always uh, good too. Uh, <laughs> so, I'll, uh, I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. Take care. Bye bye.